welcome to Twisted Vader Reviews. Today we have Transformers Generations Willy. If you've seen the Jazz, he's pretty much the same old with a different paint scheme. The paint's actually pretty nice. There's the underneath. He rolls real good. Only problem is this is the weapon that comes with him. It's a little slingshot. And underneath here, there's these little tabs where it's supposed to go. And when you lock it into place, you don't have enough clearance. It leaves the wheel off and then it's stuck. You can see it right there. Look how far down that sticks. everything all the way in there it's but anyway at least when you put it on your stand you can leave it underneath there so you don't lose it and that's him in sports car mode that's pretty much it so now we'll go to robot mode first thing you want to do is pop the doors and you can pop the feet out Underneath here, spin this around, pop up in a hill. That's his feet. Lift these up. That opens. His head automatically pops up. And spin his shoulders around. And there you have him. That's Willy in robot mode. You can put his little slingshot right here. The only thing I don't like about him is this. For some reason, there's no way to lock it in place. Flippity floppity, flippity flop, flippity flop. Anyway. So his ankles, you can move this up and down. This up and down. Knees ball joints you can even twist right here so you can get lots of different poses out of him how the wrists move this up and down see how his head keeps going up and down still and then you can twist right here both sides and that's pretty much him how much else to say you take a look at him If you like him, he's out now, everywhere. It's a new release. And that's Willy. Transformers Generations Willy. So now let's change him to vehicle mode. Easiest way to do it is to fold the feet first, flip them back, and then you can flip this all the way around. Both sides. And you can tab them, see the little tab right there? You can tab them together. Make sure our spoiler's up. And you can flip this up like that. Pull that back. Now, there's a tab here that holds this side down. So you have to put this side down first. The easiest way to do that is to fold your arms all the way out. Then you can fold him up. Right into place. Keep the arms straight. Same on this side, and see how that tab locks it in. Pretty simple. Then you want to twist the arms so that this part is facing up. You see how they're facing up? A little points. 
Then you can fold the legs all the way in by squeezing that down and this right into place and you can snap that right in. Here's the back half. Now all you have to do is fold the arms down. You gotta twist the inside. That's what I didn't do. Twist the inside right on the shoulder blade and you'll see the ball joints. Then you can fold this down right on the side. Fold this one down. And I squeeze these in together like that. And you can fold these in. As you see, it's kind of at a weird angle right there. That's how that fits into place. And there's a tab right here. And then there's a tab right there. Put the spoiler down so it fits, and there he is, back in sports car mode. And before you go put him on the shelf, put his gun back. Don't keep dropping it like I am. There you go. And here he is, back in vehicle mode. I'm going to take one quick look at him. One thing I did notice is if you see this plastic right here, I don't know if you can see it on camera. They did a good job of putting a paint over top of it, but you can tell it's a different color plastic. And, you know, from far away you don't really notice it, but you can notice it. And that's just being a little picky. And of course the wheels are plastic, and I think that about wraps it up for Transformers Generation Willy. Thank you for watching.